Islanders game night continues from the Coliseum. This organization is proud of what they do on the ice and in the community. The Islanders have several initiatives to give back all over the metro area, especially to kids. And they also like to honor people who are dedicated to giving back to others. They have a hometown hero program, and Lon Dolbar is a part of that. We also have actor Aiden Quinn joining us now. I feel very honored to have both of you here, not only for what you do professionally and what I'll call your day jobs, but also what you're doing for the community, because it's very important. And, and Lon, I know you've built a successful financial uh, business, but can you tell us a little bit about your involvement with the Center for Discovery? Well, it's, it started about 10 years ago. Um, I'm on the board of World Team Sports, an organization that takes individuals that are physically challenged and we pair them in a sporting event with individuals that are not. And we do events all around the world, uh, whether it's climbing Kilimanjaro or whether it's climbing a subsidiary peak of Everest. But for 10 years, I've gone up to the Center for Discovery and we've done an adventure team challenge with their residents who live there and are physically and emotionally challenged. And it's a three day event and it's life changing. And I bring individuals to come up, put them on the team and we spend time uh, doing this event and it's life changing. If I enjoy taking people that have ever been around anybody that's physically or emotionally challenged and having them spend days with that person. So maybe after a while they see the humanity of that person and they're not looking so much at how they're different. Of course we're all different. Everybody is different and I have to say, Aiden, I know that you're on, on the board and, and you're very active at the Center for Discovery. We just saw some video there. The first time I watched some of the video, I had goosebumps because it's amazing to see what we're doing to give back to people who deserve to have an exciting life and, and be part of activities. How did you get involved for the Center for Discovery and why is it so important to you? Well, my daughter, uh, uh, who is profoundly autistic, but she's also, thanks to the C Center for Discovery, a profoundly great organic farmer. And what the center does is it takes people with, uh, adults and children with complex conditions, medical or otherwise, autism, uh, drop seizures, you name it, uh, cerebral palsy, and gives everyone a full life, a vocational life, an outdoor life, thanks to heroes like this man and his generosity. Good citizen, <laughs> hero, you know, fireman, yeah. you know, police officer, people that served in the armed forces. I'm a good citizen. But if yes. people want to get more involved, they can go on the website, they can find out more information. Yes. Because it's not just people that are living there, there's research involved, and that's also an important component. Yes, we're, we're gonna open a specialty hospital in 2020 that will be able to, so families will be able to come and, ha and, and have a behavioral treatment so they can go home. It's also gonna save the state millions of dollars. And uh, we're, we're very excited about all the things going on at the Center for Discovery. It's really incredible place. It's www. a unique place. CenterForDiscovery.org if, <laughs> if anyone's interested. Uh, Aiden, I know you're a hockey fan, and Lon, I know you're an Islanders fan. You have an interesting Islanders story about one of the greats. Can yes. you share that? Yes, I do. I had the opportunity to meet Bobby Nystrom, and um, I've done some climbing, and uh, he was talking about doing a winter ascent in Mount Washington, so I said, why don't we do it together? So we actually climbed Mount Washington in the winter. It was about 20 below zero, and uh, we made it to the top and got back down. It's amazing. He's I, I, so athletic. He looks like he could still play, right? Oh, when we were in that guide shack and he, he was getting dressed, I was like, I'm in for it now. <laughs> well, you, you've done some amazing climbs. Both of you are doing amazing work in the community outside of your professional careers. You're fantastic in elementary. Love, oh, love watching you. the show. Thank you so much for all you're doing. It, and we're excited that you're going to be honored here with the Islanders, the hometown hero, something the Islanders have done for many years now, honoring the people in our community that are doing extraordinary things to help other people. A very impressive endeavor.